Welcome to Serif Photo Plus. In this tutorial, we'll take you on a short tour of the program and show you some of the basics you'll need to get started. When Photo Plus first opens, you'll be greeted by the Startup Wizard. Here, you can start a new image or animation, import a scanned file, or begin an HDR merge. You can also organise your files in Photo Plus Organizer, open an existing image, or access the tutorials. Let's look at the interface. At the top we have our menus, Standard Toolbar and Context Toolbar. On the left we have the Tools Toolbar and next to that the How To tab. On the right we have our Main Studio tabs, such as the Layers, Adjustments and Colour tab, and at the bottom we have the Snapping Toggle and the Hint Line. The Hint Line provides really useful hints and tips and shows the cursor position when you move the pointer over the canvas. We also have the Documents tab, which is collapsed by default, to save space. You can collapse or expand tabs at any time by clicking the small arrow next to them. You can also expand or collapse sets of tabs by clicking the Tab Menu button and choosing the option from the menu. Photo Plus has many powerful features to make editing your photos really easy. It even has dedicated studios so that you can quickly fix or enhance your photos and even cut them out. If you make a mistake, the History tab allows you to revert back to an earlier stage. To zoom into an image, click the Zoom tool and then drag over the area you want to magnify. To zoom out, either right click or select one of the options from the View menu. In the Adjustments tab, the adjustment layers allow you to quickly make non-destructive adjustments to your image. If you don't like an adjustment, you can simply delete the layer. The tools in the toolbar are split into groups to make it easy to find the tool you want. You'll find tools for moving, transforming, straightening or cropping your photo at the top of the toolbar. Next, you have the various selection tools. After these are the editing tools and finally, the warping, text and path editing tools. If you want to make your whole image bigger or smaller, you can do this from the image menu. I'll just increase the size of my image, ready for printing. Hopefully this tutorial has given you a brief overview of the features available in Photo Plus. For information on how to get creative with your photos, or perform detailed adjustments, see the How To tab Photo Plus Help or the other online tutorials. Thanks for watching.